With the Russia-Ukraine war well into its third year, Moscow has claimed that it launched strikes on the latter's decision-making centers. The warring nations have both made statements on a fresh series of attacks carried out by their respective armed forces. On one hand, Russia said that it also shot down several unmanned aerial vehicles. On the other, Ukraine also claimed that it targeted Russian military installations, including their command posts. Additionally, Ukraine's top general also said that the troops fought Russian armed forces multiple times on the front line in the last 24 hours. As the war continues to rage on, Moscow carried out targeted airstrikes on Ukraine's northeastern city of Kharkiv. According to police officials, the bombing killed one person and wounded 10 others, including four children. Authorities also went on to state that the attack was allegedly carried out using a new type of weapon, which is being identified by the local police as UMPD-30, a guided aerial bomb. Він достатньо потужний для того, щоб фактично розвалити два багатоповерхових будинки, між якими він влучив, і ще поруч декілька будинків, які знаходяться на відстані. Тобто це вже може казати про досить потужну силу, вибухову силу цього пристрою. Він може використовуватися саме для враження людей, тобто фугасної дії. Meanwhile, on the maritime front, Ukraine's navy has claimed that it has sunk or damaged one-third of all Russian warships in the Black Sea ever since Russia invaded the country in February 2022. The statement comes on the heels of Ukrainian naval forces carrying out its latest strike on a landing ship docked in Russian-occupied Crimea. The targeted ship was reportedly a Ukrainian vessel before being captured by Russia in 2014. For all the latest news, download the Wion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.